For number 11, for the low buttock contour doing the slash method, we're going to be doing the same thing, except for slash method means we're cutting something off. So we're actually gonna slash on the crotch line and we're gonna slash up to the hip line. So I'm just gonna pick a line somewhere in here, close to my seam allowances. I'm gonna cut this chunk off. Okay, so I have it totally separate. You're gonna be on a front. Uh huh, because we're making the matcher. Okay. And we're gonna be sliding it along this line, but we're gonna be raising it a quarter of an inch right here. Same as we did on the other, so it'll match. I'm gonna use a much smaller piece of filler because I don't need a ginormous piece. Okay. Then all I have to do is correct the two seam allowances right here. Now, does that seem like it did very much for our buttocks? It doesn't seem like it did anything for our buttocks, right? But what we did is we gave it a little more space here to counteract with the back and it actually makes the shelf in between the legs a little longer which is what you need. This is number 11. It is the low buttocks contour. It is a quarter of an inch increase in correction. This is the slash method. It is a pant front. size 10 half scale and my name is Jen.